space reforms with the inclusive support by ESPA, NSIL, NSPACE, DRDO, Defence Space Agency have provided the opportune moment for our non-governmental organisations and the private sector. To respond, the response of multiple participants to our DISC-8 and IDEX Prime Space are definite steps that need appreciation. These times also demand that the institutions and established leaders of industry should handhold young entrepreneurs and ensure that the spirit of innovation seamlessly permeates in our entire system. We as a nation have to also realize the importance of creating a pool of trained space manpower in the country and military, which requires all, us, all of us to be agile to learn and re relearn the intricacies of this domain. I am sure that uh, such resolve and commitment by our enmeshed military, ISRO, MSMEs, startup base would continue to receive support from the government, which will ensure that we build highly capable Atmirbhar defense space ecosystem. We as a nation also realize the importance of building partnerships and sharing of potentials in the space domain with our friendly foreign countries. I am sure that this symposium will also provide the ideal opportunity to understand the and share perspectives of a national space strategy. It will surely assist us in developing a far-fetching defense space strategy towards augmenting our space-based defense capabilities and strengthening our national space security apparatus. I look forward for thoughtful interactions. My best wishes to everyone. Thank you and Jai Hind. Dignitaries on the dais, distinguished guests, friends in the media, ladies and gentlemen. One of the hazards of speaking last is whatever you wanted to say has already been said. However, let me put forward DRDO's perspective in this very critical area. DRDO over the last few years has started increasing our focus on this very critical domain. We are looking at space-based surveillance. We are looking at space situational awareness. We are also looking at protecting our space-based assets. All these areas, <coughs> our capabilities are improving, but a lot needs to be done. We are looking at a new model to develop these capabilities. Our earlier model was most of the development used to happen in the laboratory. And then we used to look at an industry to whom we could transfer the, the system that we had developed. But for space and going forward in other technologies too, we are now looking at working very closely with industry as well as academia right from the development stage. So we have several mechanisms that we have started. We have what is called the DRDO Industry Academia Centers of Excellence that we have opened in 15 academic institutions, mostly IITs and ISC within the country. And in all these centers of excellence, some technologies or the other relevant to this domain are going to be the focus areas for those centers of excellence. So if there are any academic academicians or industry startups or MSMEs or larger companies here, my request to you is please <coughs> work with us closely so we can help our country achieve these capabilities much faster than what we have been able to do for all our other systems. I am sure, with the kind of enthusiasm I see, the auditorium is full today. I think if we work 
together. I have no doubts in my mind that in the next 15 to 20 years, we should be able to achieve leadership in this very critical domain. On a lighter note, I see a sea of blue. So the Air Force is taking space much more seriously than the other services. <coughs> but I, but this capability, I'm sure, is required by all the three services. And going forward, anyway, the warfare has to be fought together. So my best, I have seen the schedule and it is excellent. I think the organizers, I would like to congratulate the Indian Space Association for putting together such a schedule. I'm sure whoever is attending this seminar will be enriched by their presence. My best wishes for successful deliberations and my request is if you can come up with some specific recommendations at the end, it would benefit the community. Thank you.